Hi, I'm Alex. I'm for Lego Park Support. Uh, today we're going to show you how to replace the interface on the Revit here. So, um, what you're going to need for this is a 2.5mm hex key, and the replacement parts, uh, interface board, and the ribbon cable. So, the first thing you want to make sure is that your SD card is out, and that your platform is raised. Next, what you're going to do is remove the six nylon bolts from around the interface. You only really have to unscrew them a little bit and then you can take them out by, with your fingers. Next what you're going to do is remove the ribbon cable from the back of the interface board, right here. And you just pop right out. Okay. Now you can remove the interface board straight away and take the silicon uh, keypad and just place it to the side. Now you're going to take the bot, put it on its left side, and remove the one bolt holding the bottom panel in place. I'll just grab that later. Now, you see the, uh, the, inter the ribbon cable is actually attached to the mighty board, right here. And you're going to move that. And then you can slide the ribbon cable out from the top here, pretty easily. And out through that. And put it to the side. And then you're going to take the new ribbon cable. First, you'll attach it to the mighty board, and it'll only go in one way. Now, in order to attach it to the interface, it's going to have to twist and come up like this. So we're going to, as we put it through here, twist it around, just one twist, 180 degrees. And then go through. Push it up through here. Okay. <coughs> you have your new interface board. Move that. And before you put that on, you can actually now replace. Seems to have misplaced the bolt. What I'm going to do is actually, I'm going to set set the silicon keypad in first. And then I'm going to put the interface board in, 
pushing the wires a little bit to the side just to make sure that you clear a path for the SD card port. Okay. And plugging in the interface cable, the ribbon cable. Put all of the bolts through. You can just go ahead and put them all through just to hold things in place. And then you can, and I like to just sort of finger tighten all the bolts on first and then I'll go through and tighten them with the hex key.